Esam is in the building. You've had a year, brother. Twelve, twelve. That's when my story started. You know, what I'm saying my mom was that was that was the day she was born, right? And even though like my story started like with my ancestors, my mother's story directly affects me. You see what I'm saying? All right. So so that's why I think the the significance of twelve, twelve. Shout out to Showdown tonight, man. Cop that new album, 1212. It's coming out on 1212. You want some real? You want some real shit from the hood? You want some struggle? You want some honesty? Cop that album. Cop it. Right now. Don't sleep. Now. Don't sleep. Welcome, because he is from the city. This man holds it down for the city, and everybody know hold this on, man. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah. Hey, son. My sisters can't walk in the streets, and they say the west of my home. They just kill with a hell of a slaughter and melon. And if you don't see it, there's no point in telling. Then my life is tough, and don't tell me they're tough enough. 1860, but I can't because they cover it. I'm dreaming, I'm locked up inside. Wondering, lost in my mind. Pause and reflect on my time. My brothers are locked up without it. If I'm blaming the west, and I probably ain't lying. They helped in the street, and they're schooling a lot. In the prison, the music is high. It's a if you point at the east, and you probably is not. The killers are covered with suicide. Living in the time when nothing surprises me. My my eyes go dry and I desensitize the past these lies Collateral damage, not feeling it Setting up vices and dropping these bombs on the innocent Flipping the nemesis, blame a religion But then it's our politics, murder boy The label of terrorists, go to a terrorist Terror by Japanese, massacre natives Enslaving the Africans, look what is happening Living in land of the thieves with my people with shackles Just trying to break free Much love, appreciate y'all It's not all that Make some noise You should ask him where the radio station is. Oh, let's get real. Nice. Listener Power Radio, KEXP 90.3 FM, Seattle, occupied Duwamish territory. We are streaming live and worldwide on kxp.org and via the kxp mobile app 
We got a special guest in the studio. South Seattle's own Esam. You just check that mic. Yo, what it do? Esam is in the building. You've had a year, brother. I guess, man, let's give him an introduction, though. So you're from Holly Park? Yep. Born, raised. born and raised? Not born. I was born in Morocco. Born in Morocco? Yep. Excuse me. Raised yeah. in Holly Park. Raised in Holly Park, yeah. When, when did you start having that idea, like you wanted to approach hip-hop music more as a Nasheeds? You know, so so I, w- I was, you know, I was always uh, spinning over beats, you know what I mean? But, yeah. uh, you know, it got to a point where where uh, me and my bro, uh, CDQ, we went out to Malaysia. CDQ's in the studio right CDQ's now. CDQ's in the studio right now. We was out in Malaysia, and then I seen uh, I seen uh, one of the bros, one of the big bros, Muslim be live. Uh-huh. Right, he was performing live, uh-huh. like, and it was dope. I was, I never heard anything like it before, you know. And he was, it was at the Ilm Arts Festival in 2015, and uh, he was he was spitting over like a vocal harmony. I was like, yo, this sounds raw. This sounds dope, you know. Yeah. And then uh, I remember we went back home, me and CDQ, and we're like, yo, we should try this out. You know, that's that's because my bro CDQ is a beatboxer. Right. Like, he he's been beatboxing since like back in the day. Yeah. Like, he moved from Malaysia, um, and he was doing like t- uh, competitions and stuff out there. Uh, but we decided to give it a try. Uh, CDQ actually he he uh, sent out um, uh, like a few beats to me, uh, produced with his with his voice, you know. Mm. And uh, my bro Petty Pro, uh, you know, we got together. Um, and Petty Pro, you know, he came from the music industry. He worked with like Nipsey Hussle, Young Buck, and a bunch Ooh. of other artists. He produced for Nipsey. Yeah. Petty Pro's the homie. Yeah, man. Petty Pro's. I didn't even know he had that production. Yeah, man. No, no, Petty Pro, man. Like, he was doing this thing, man. But he stepped away from it, mm. uh, and and. Uh, he decided to work with me. You know, we, decided, we decided to work on work on a uh, uh, you know uh, project together, mm-hmm. and uh, that's how West is my home came about. So West is, West is my home was the debut video. Yeah, unintentionally two two years ago. Yeah, let's let's get into it right now. Black bodies get bodied by cops, and I say the West is my home. Get arrested for making the clock, and I say the West is my home. My mama she barely could breathe, and I say the West is my home. My sisters can't walk in the streets and I say the West is my home. What are some of the most surprising experiences you've had in the last two years? Uh with music. I think like the fact that like I mean on this journey, like I've been meeting, you know what I'm saying, uh uh like family even, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Um uh and and I think one of the one of the biggest things that happened in my life mm. um, was me and my biological father for the first time, wow. and I feel like that journey started with being vulnerable, right, through creative expression. Mm. You know, so had I not decided, you know, to 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 make that that step, and and you know what I mean, getting into into you know creative expression, and sharing my story, I don't think I would be in a position uh, where I would be comfortable enough to 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 make that that that, that step to meet my father. You know what I mean? After all these years, right? Yeah. Where, where, where did you meet him? I met him in Egypt. In Egypt. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Man, what was, what was that? What was that experience like? Like, you know, like it was, um, it, it, it was deep, man. Um, you know, I never spoke to him, never seen his face, never, you know, heard his voice. Mm. You know, for twenty four years of my life, you know, wow. and uh, uh, you know, just me and him. Uh, it, 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 I, I learned a lot. I learned about. I, learned, I used to think I knew what forgiveness meant, but I didn't. Learn what forgiveness meant. So I met him for the first time. You know wow. what I mean? Wow. Um, yeah, but it was deep. It was definitely a heavy experience. Yeah. Yeah. So we got the album coming next Wednesday. Yep. December twelfth. Yeah. To, to, I'm so excited. All vocally produced. Yeah. I'm uh, a CDQ. You know yeah. what I mean? Elias Smile. Yeah. Uh, you know Petty Pro, Sam Anderson. You know what I mean? Shout you know, out to Sam. You know, all of them. You know they, they, they. You know they came together to to work on this on yeah. this project with me. You know. And you got the show coming. Yo, I got a couple shows. I got a show in Netherlands uh, on, in, on the 16th mm-hmm. uh, in Rotterdam. Mm. Uh, and, I, and I got a Five City UK tour mm. um, right after that. Um, you know what I mean? So, mm-hmm. And uh, you wanted to talk about one of the songs? Uh, yeah, man. So, So Many Souls, man. Um, the end of 2017, um, mm-hmm. uh, we lost, we lost uh, a couple of brothers uh, in our community. Um, mm. uh, to gun violence, um, and and it's not the first time something like that happened. Definitely not the last. Right. But I remember I was in the Netherlands uh, when when it happened. I heard the news. Actually, I heard the news. Uh, the, the first brother, uh, um, and then literally a week later, 
Mm. We heard it. We heard. We got another news. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Um, for another brother, and I was just like, like, like what's going on? Like, both from 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 the South Seattle community, right? From different right. you know, parts of town, um, uh, part, parts of the, the same strip, Martin Luther King. Right. Um, and I remember it. Did, it didn't hit me. Hit me until until uh, I came back home. Right. Mm. Like literally, like like when I when I came back to Seattle, I was like. It just the atmosphere feels different, you know. Right. And um, uh, my bro CDQ, you know, he he produced a beat with Sam Anderson, and uh, he gave it to me. Uh, and he was like, "Yo, uh, you know, check this out," you know. And then just automatically, man, I just I just started to to process everything uh, through through uh, the vibrations of this instrumental, you know. Uh, and I started to to just kind of articulate what I was feeling uh, with the whole experience. It's not the first time we lost people in our community. Course, you know what I mean? Of course. Um, uh, and 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 uh, I titled this track "So Many Souls," right? And um, uh, like I use a metaphor in this in this piece: um, uh, tears are falling down, mm -hmm. uh, but you can't see them mm -hmm. uh, because the rain the rain keeps falling, you know. That's right. All right, so like, you can't see our tears because because the rain is falling. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, you know, it's the city of rain, right? That's right. Um, so. Yeah, man. Props to you, and also, man. Just as 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 a very young OG in the in the in the hip hop community, mm -hmm. you know, it's dope for me to see you doing something that I feel like our generation failed on mm -hmm. a little bit. Yeah, just in in connecting the global artists that you're working with mm -hmm. to um, to the local community, like mm -hmm. bringing them here. So, man, that's beautiful to see. Uh -huh. Yeah. So the album's on Wednesday. There's yeah. a show on Wednesday. Show on Wednesday. Meet Street Studio and my bro Face of Silas flying out all the way from London to host the event. Amazing. All right. So it's gonna be dope. That's and we got local talent as well. It's gonna be fired. Yeah. Man. Twelve twelve on Wednesday. Yeah. KXP with the world premiere. Man, thank you so much for sharing it with us. No, nah, that's love, man. I appreciate you, man. I appreciate everybody listening. Um, tapping with me, M A S S E O N E three nine on my Instagram to stay tuned for future projects and notices and releases and all that. Yeah. Yep. That's what it is, man. Twelve yeah. twelve Wednesday.